stand, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Yo, what's poppin'? It's your friendly neighborhood rap man. Uh, Tim Tim here. We are here. We're gonna send it to Chris with weather because Izzy doesn't like to wake up. Thanks guys, you already know it's cold outside so I don't know why they stuck me here. Probably because they don't got anything else better to do. Anyways, when y'all walked in this morning, it was 21 degrees outside, but for some reason, it felt like seven. Anyways, it's only supposed to get up to 26, which we all know will be the highlight of our day. Anyways, later on tonight, it'll be around 19 degrees. You're welcome for that obvious weather report. Now back to Isaac. Thanks, Chris. For lunch today on lines one and two, quesadilla. Line three, soup and salad bar with broccoli soup. Line four, breakfast pizza and calzone. And line five, as per usual, is closed. Happy birthday goes out to Cassandra Cervantes. Now let's send it over to Moa Sports. Hey, kids. Last night in the boys swimming sectional prelims, Evan Jordan placed first in the 50 yard freestyle with a time of 21.9. He also placed sixth in the 100 yard butterfly with a time of 56.66. Tyler Harness placed 16th in the 200 yard freestyle with a time of 201.40. He also placed 13th in the 500 yard freestyle with a time of 530.62. And Adam Haynes placed 12th in the 100 yard breaststroke with a time of 111.17. Tonight there will be a pair of boys basketball games, one JV and the other simply V. It's at Southmont and as to be expected, it's against Southmont. Good luck guys. Elijah Anthony will be wrestling at state competition at Bankers Life Fieldhouse at 6.30 tonight. I've been told that today is Pin a Wrestler Day so, and that you can come down to Mr. Salee's room to procure a safety pin for the sole purpose of pinning it to Elijah's clothing for good luck. That does not mean his body. Be safe. No stabbing. He will be leaving for Indy during lunch, so be sure to get that done before then. Isaac? Thanks, Mo. A congratulation goes out to Peach Cobbler for being the winner of the very first Hot Dog Challenge Escape Room Edition. All the teams are participated at a great time. Make sure that you don't miss out on all the fun next time. A thank you to Mr. Dudley, Mr. Taylor, and Daniel Ehrman for helping organize and run the escape room. The Clinton County Junior Fair Council is having a call out. They're seeking hardworking, responsible individuals to join their junior council for the Clinton County and 4 H Fair and other community events. Applications can be picked up as student services. If you missed the opening night for Big Broadcast, you could show face tonight for the encore performance. Ask anyone, it's a great time. Come out and show your support for all those brave enough to be on that stage. Remember to buy a yearbook at the bookstore for $35. They're sold lower than production costs, so be sure to purchase one. We'll be right back after this short commercial break. Well, today If you couldn't already get enough of Dallas, be sure to check out today's episode of Ask Dallas. Link is in the description. And that's going to be all for the announcements today. Say hello to all the 8th graders as they walk by and be nice. Let be nice. Reminder to stay hydrated. Only water. No straws 2019. <laughs>